It's no secret that Peach's castle in Super Mario 64 is filled with all sorts of weird stuff like the secret aquarium floating in the sky and trapdoors leading to a dark underworld. But perhaps the one thing that fascinates me the most in terms of design is none other than the Princess Secret Slide. It is located on the upper level of the main lobby of the castle and requires one star to enter and upon entering, you find yourself in a barren room that leaves you with questions that Nina asks where is the level? Why is this room so empty? You jump kick around the walls to search for clues and lo and behold, you find yourself in a labyrinthian brightly orange colored striped room with a blue coin block that your grandpa out of habit and the coins appear and the clock is ticking down. You instinctively follow the trail of blue coins down the giant slide and do your best to collect all the coins in hopes of getting enough for a 100 coin star. In the midst of the fast paced sliding, you try your best to steer clear of the realist segment and admire the pitch black void and nothingness staring right back at you. You accidentally slip but trying to get that sneaky water mushroom and watch as Mario plunged into the void helpless. Then somehow, Mario appears inside the castle from the ceiling, which makes no sense whatsoever. You return to the slide to try to complete it properly this time, and you obtain the star for the course. That was fun! I'm gonna try to go for a faster run this time. Little did the player know, if you finish the race under 20 seconds, you get an additional star, which is pretty sneaky on the development team's part. Now, as for the slide itself, I imagine Peach built this as an evacuation center in case of emergencies for Toast to enter and slide down and take refuge whenever there is an evasion. Either that, or the residents can enter this room simply for fun, which seems like a nice place to relax. I like to think Peach used black magic to create this giant floating slide in the middle of nowhere that magically teleports anyone who fell off. Whatever the purpose may be for the slide, it has always stood out to me for being one of the greatest and weirdest locations in any Mario game. Thank you for watching, comment down below what you think is the reason as to why the slide was built, and please like and subscribe for more videos like this.